Alright y'all, what's going on? This is Caleb coming to you with another video. Uh, hope you, hopefully you guys had a very, very Merry Christmas. Happy Holidays to you people that don't celebrate Christmas. Hope you guys have a safe New Year and everything. So let's get right into this review. So as you guys see, this is a review over the Nike Kyrie 2. Uh, I have the insoles out, but this is a video over the Nike Kyrie 2. Uh, hopefully you guys like the on foot and the detail shots. I worked my butt off on those. But uh, yeah, we're just gonna get to the traction, the materials, the back, the heel tab, the tongue, and we'll be set. So first we're gonna start with the traction. The traction is a curved traction, in case you guys didn't know, it's not like a regular herring bone. Herring bone. It's like a curved traction, so if you guys wanna do a hard jab, it's kinda, be good. It's kinda gonna be low to the ground. It's gonna have like a, a curved feel to it. So if, for you guards, this would be really good, but if you're a big man, it's, this is not really the shoe for you. Uh, so yeah, uh, you guards, this is a perfect shoe for you. So it, it's, it retails for 125, so this might be a perfect grab. The strap is white and black. It has like this marble effect to it on the uh, check. I will have some B-roll playing in the background so you guys can have a detailed look at that. Uh, the strap is like a KD4 strap. Really, really similar to the KD4 strap. I do prefer the KD4 strap. This strap looks okay. Uh, if you guys want to see what the shoe looks like without the strap, it kind of looks better in my opinion without the strap. But uh, yeah, that's the strap. It's okay. Some people might prefer it, so two each is on though. Uh, so yeah. Um, there's another marble effect on the Nike check right here. It's like a black distressed uh, check. So that's another good touch. And as you guys want to know, this right here, all the all the colors on the heel. First, first of all, it says uh, number two, and all the colors on the heel is like a navy blue, a peach, green, pink. So this kind of goes with everything. Just throw some black distressed denim on, maybe a, a plain white H and M tee or something, elongated tee or something, and just throw these on and cuff them over the top. It'll look really clean, especially when you loose lace them. So this will probably look really, really clean with that fit. So don't go too like over the top with this. Just go on something real simple and let the shoes talk for itself uh, so that would be a really good fit idea last thing I want to go over is the tongue the tongue has a very very good tumble leather uh, it's not like Jordan brand quality for something like the uh, 72 and tens but it's okay for Nike uh, I know Nike is Jordan but it's okay for a Nike basketball shoe the leather is very very tumbled as Kyrie and if you, uh, I'm, I have the Kyrie ones. If you guys see, it has one. Uh, the Kyrie just has the K with the one. These actually have the K and the two, so that's a really good touch. And then on the inside of the tongue has Kyrie with JBY. I don't understand what that says. What that says. So uh, yeah. Last thing I want to go over it too is the strap. Inside the strap, it has H H H or something. H two H's or something. I don't know what that stands for. I have to look that up. But uh, yeah. All right. Last thing I want to go over. Is the insoles? The insole has Kyrie in it. Too bad I don't. The other shoes over there, uh, but as you guys can see, it has Kyrie in it. I will have some B roll. Uh, it just has Kyrie Irving doing a quick move for some quick crossover, and it does have a footbed right here, which is very padded, so uh, it just adds extra support. So guys, this is my review over the Nike Kyrie Two. This shoe does retail for 125. You guys can pick it up in the vintage colorway. I think that's what they're called. Uh, they're releasing like January 3rd or something. Or you can get the Christmas colorway. Uh, the Christmas colorway actually has a different outsole, though it has an icy outsole. So you guys can pick that up for 125 I believe. And yeah, my friend Dev is in the back of the camera. Off. But uh, yeah, you guys can pick these up for 125 uh, Very good shoe. Good on your good, good bang for your buck shoe. So yeah, if you guys like this video, please rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.